What is going on friends and welcome back to the Minecraft Hub channel. So today we have a bit of a different video and this one is a map overview. So we're going to be looking at the escape game created by other app 2B and Pyroclash and they have created an amazing escape room in Minecraft and it is so fun to play. You can't break blocks uh, unless you have the right tools and you can't really die or anything so you don't have to worry about lava or drowning in water but it is a lot of fun to play and definitely very challenging. The goal for this map is to beat it in under 30 minutes and unfortunately, I hate to say it, it took me 32 minutes. I just got stuck in one of the rooms and couldn't find the solution, but I eventually did and I would definitely recommend checking this map out. It is so much fun and it's just a quick little game and definitely a break from regular Minecraft, so it was a lot of fun. There are several different rooms for you to find solutions in and it's definitely pretty difficult. There's things you have to find, you have to kind of uh, think a little outside the box at some parts, so it's definitely something really fun to play around with and to challenge yourself uh, to try to find the solutions for all these rooms. If you would like to play this map, the link for it will be down in the description below. Uh, I've left the link uh, for the exact one that I downloaded, and you have to change your Minecraft to the 1.15.2, which is super easy, just go into your installations and you can do it there. I did a quick tour of the map in spectator mode after I finished it, and I've got to say it was definitely a lot of work that went into this map. There is a ton of command blocks, different redstone things, so a lot of work went into creating this and it paid off because the map is great. This map is also multiplayer compatible, so if you and a friend want to play this and try to figure out all the little... Uh, Easter eggs and everything in the map then definitely you can do that you can load it up in a realm world or something like that and just play with a friend this map is a hundred percent completable I did do it myself so if you're stuck at any part just know that there is a solution to it you just have to think a little outside the box don't be afraid to do a little bit of crafting at some point uh, just as a little helpful hint but other than that, you really shouldn't have to do much crafting. There's only one part where you do have to do it. Also, if you guys enjoy these type of videos, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below if there's some of the other maps you'd like us to play and give tours of. We're welcome to adventure maps, escape rooms, sky blocks, literally anything. So just let us know what you want to see and we will probably give it a tour. Back on the subject of this map, I'd have to say that one of my favorite rooms is probably the first tunnel that you spawn in. It's definitely very interesting and there's a few little secrets that you can find in it. But the last room, the waiting room, which you just saw me look into right there, that is the room that I got stuck in for probably a solid 10-15 minutes. I just had literally no idea what to do once I was in there and I was running around going back trying to find other secret things across the map and I just could not figure it out. But it is doable, you just have to figure out the right way to go about it so definitely still check it out and you know try not to do what I did. There's not much more that can be said about this map without giving away some major spoilers so if you guys do decide to play it the link for it is down in the description below. It is a lot of fun and I would really recommend playing it. Uh, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like down below, and if you're new to the channel, definitely be sure to subscribe. We have a lot of different Minecraft content, and I'm sure you'll enjoy some of our other stuff. So, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.